I was born and raised in Hawaii, so my love for the ocean started very early. But it wasn't until my education about the oceans in my 20s where I really realized how vitally important this ecosystem was and how it is 100% our responsibility to care for it so that the air that we breathe, I mean, every, everything that you can think of comes from the ocean. Uh, but, but I mean that literally. I mean, the air that we take in is dependent on this ecosystem being healthy. And so I would adver I advocate for endangered marine mammals and and um, recycling and everything else that I did. But I, one of the things that I really was my, my dream and my goal was to be able to create a commodity, create a company where the platform for the oceans just got bigger. We created a fabric for active wear that had never existed before. A blend that was 100% recycled, but was also, you know, milled here our waste, waste in the United States that was being used to create this product. And so once we kind of sort of uh, patented our own kind of blend that was on par with anything that you could buy out there that wasn't sustainable, we knew that we had something. So until I could see that quality, I wasn't interested in creating this product because I don't want people to buy a truly sustainable product and not have it be the quality of a company that doesn't have a sustainable initiative. It has to be the best that it can be, and that's what we achieved, and that's why I started the company. When women wear the print, I want them to feel like empowered ambassadors. I want people to say, well, I love that print, and start the conversation. Well, it's not just a print, actually. It looks like the world, it, you know what I mean? It looks like cloud and ocean and land because the fabric is made out of this and it's, you know, it's pro-planet for these reasons. And create these sort of ambassadors and people that are just out there because you never know who you're going to affect.